Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So with 14 days left until Christmas, I decided to help you guys out and make a list of what you guys should add to your Christmas wish list. Creating your Christmas wish list can be really hard. Every single year around Christmas time, I always forget what I want to add to my wish list. So I made a list of more than 100 items that you guys should add to your 2022 Christmas wish list. <laughs> So I've organized this list into different categories and the first category is clothing items. Around the fall time and winter, Gilmore Girls is such a show that just everybody can watch like and put in the background of anything. And so Rory Gilmore always wears these chunky sweaters and they look super comfortable and versatile so that you can wear it basically anytime and they look so nice and they look like you're trying so hard but in reality they just throw on the sweater and it's super comfy so there is this one on the site princess polly it's called princess polly anya oversized sweater and basically it's just like a chunky beige sweater that you can wear during the fall and winter season during winter i also really like to wear like athletic wear or like really comfy clothes so something that's super comfy is the lululemon scuba pullover um this one is 118 dollars so if you're looking for a more affordable option um you can always choose the amazon dupe i'll have everything linked down below so that you can look for that um the amazon dupe is only 35 dollars and it's pretty similar to the real one, except it doesn't have like the zipper attachment that has the lemon logo on it. Everybody calls it the BBL jacket because it like makes you really snatched. And this is also $118. So I have also found an Amazon dupe. The Amazon dupe is only $25, so go cop it. Another must have in your closet is the airy cross waist um, flare leggings their leggings are super comfy and they're just to spice up your leggings oversized zip ups are also very versatile and something that you can easily grab in your closet some of the brands are brandy melville and paxson and also you can find some on amazon for gift cards from clothing brands i really like airy lululemon princess polly um abercrombie and fitch hollister and there's so many more that are great clothing brands, but these are my ultimate favorites. The next category is jewelry, and my favorite places to get jewelry is from Princess Polly, Altered State, and Amazon. At Princess Polly, some of my favorite earrings are the pearl dangle earrings. I really like dainty jewelry that's very elegant. So another one is the gemstone dangle earrings and they also have a ton of hoop earring set options for you guys to choose from. And from Amazon, there are a ton of ring sets that are cheap and some earring sets that are also cheap. A precaution you should take with Amazon is that you should check the reviews just to see if they green. Um, something that I personally am getting one of my friends is a Amazon custom friendship bracelet. These can be kind of expensive. The ones I got and the ones pictured here are 50 bucks, but they're so cute and I really love them. And we're gonna have them for a while, so I think it's worth it. The next category is shoes. Some shoes that are really trending right now are Air Jordan 1s. They are so cute and I really love all the different colors and the different variety that they have. Air Max 270s, these are so popular. I have the pink ones as you have seen in my past videos. New Balance 550s, I really like the orange and like the light green colors. They just look super cute with like all different kinds of outfits and they're so popular right now. A shoe must have is definitely high top Converse. I feel like everybody has high top Converse these days. I have black ones. They're such staple basic and they're like an everyday type shoe. You can also get them embroidered if you want to be different. These floral embroiders are from Etsy and they are absolutely adorable and 
I want some. Another shoe that I literally wish I had were um, Doc Martens. These are so expensive though, so I have also found some Amazon dupes for 70 bucks. Another shoe that's really trending recently is the Ugg Tasman shoes, and these are so cute and so comfy, and overall they're just a necessity. My favorite category by far is the makeup category. I really love makeup items, and I think every Christmas I ask for something that's makeup. Number one, Dior Lip Oil, the Fenty Lip Gloss. I've heard a lot of great things about this one. The REM Lip Gloss, the Dior Lip Reviver. A lot of people invest in the Dior Lip Oil, and I feel like not enough people invest in the Lip Reviver. It just like gives color to the lips. The Dior Backstage Rosy Blush. The Dior Eyelash Primer. Not a lot of people talk about this, but I really love this because it says that it will help the health of your lashes and it promotes growth as well. Rare Beauty Blush. Oh, this one is so popular and as it should be because it is amazing. I've tried it at the store once and I really loved it because it was so pigmented and you only had to put on a little bit. A Shiseido eyelash curler. Everyone in my family has the Shiseido eyelash curler and everybody has said good things about it. It really keeps your lashes up all day. The Ilia Limitless Lash. Guys, invest. This is proven by many TikTokers that it keeps your lashes voluminous and lengthened. Benetint. This product, guys, I wish I literally had it. Benetint is so nice because it's so versatile for your cheeks and for your lips. And of course, the infamous Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Filter is a staple once again. Something that not a lot of people talk about for Christmas gifts are makeup sets. These makeup sets are so nice because you're saving so much money and you get to try out everything. So some of the ones that I would like are Grande Serum Set, the Charlotte Tilbury Set, and there's many more that you can search up. You can also get these at Nordstrom or Ulta. Some gift cards for beauty are Ulta Beauty, Sephora, MAC, and Nordstrom. Hair care. This is another category that I really enjoy. Hair care is something that's very important. I've recently been researching about hair care because my hair used to be very brittle and since I had really long hair, the bottoms had a lot of split ends and they were so unhealthy. So yeah, some of these are really essential for really healthy hair. The hair oils that I really recommend and seen people rave about is the Olaplex Number no. 7 Bonding Oil. This is for styling. Another one is the Jisoo Hair Oil. This one's more expensive, but it also like works very well. The Rosemary Oil and the Pumpkin Seed Oil for the roots before you shower. Olaplex anything, honestly. I specifically recommend number no. 6. Hair tools, a curling iron, the Dyson Air Wrap, and if you want to save more money, the Revlon One Step Voluminizer. And then for a straightening iron, it's the Dyson Corral. This one is wireless, but if you're not willing to pay that much, then I recommend a straightening iron from like Hot Tools or Con Air. There are Amazon heatless curling rods. And then you can also get rollers for like a blowout. Some accessories that I really love that encourage hair health is silk pillowcase i've heard that helps your skin as well as your hair and silk scrunchies it's much lighter on the hair and some claw clips that i recommend are claw clips from amazon target tony rose is a really good brand their claw clips are a little bit more expensive but they keep your hair in all day you like don't have to adjust it the next category is technology. This section is a little bit more expensive, so this is like for your like parents or family to get you instead of like your friends. A technology that's really been helping me is my iPad and my iPad pencil. This really helps me with school stuff, like I can write anything down, I can write things in my planner, and overall just increases productivity, so I really encourage you to get one. Paper-like screen protector if you have an iPad already. 
this really helps with your handwriting some cases that i really like are the case by cases and the wildflower cases these cases are so cute and i literally love them something that's very unrealistic but it's also on my list is the airpod max they are so cute but they're also 500 bucks so you could put that on your list and see if anyone's willing to pay that much Another alternative for that is the Sony wireless headphones. Um, a disposable camera. Everybody needs one of these. Get Spotify Premium. A CD slash record player. Like, I want one. The next category is perfumes. Some of the perfumes that I've heard really good things about are the Sol de Janeiro fragrance mist. Billie Eilish perfume. This one just smells literally scrumptious. Ariana Grande Cloud Perfume, Glossier You Perfume, The Seven Virtues Vanilla Woods Gemstone Perfume Oil. My friend recommended this to me. Daisy by Marc Jacobs and Perfect by Marc Jacobs. I've heard that this is a very sweet smell. I know Charlie D'Amelio this year came out with her perfume called Born Dreamer and I know that this perfume has like fruity scents so. and then some cheaper options from Bath and Body Works Vanilla Bean Noel a thousand wishes one in the stars is also such a good perfume it smells so good room decor okay so i've been really into room decor recently so some of the things from amazon that i really like are the aesthetic candles decorative pillows for your bed there are some that are seasonal and you can interchange them collage pictures i have a ton of collage pictures there they're just so cute a sunset lamp everybody needs their signature fluffy blanket i've had this one for a while. This one's actually heated. And I really love that because when it's like cold out, I love to be warm in my bed. Hanging plants, they're so cute for your room. No matter the aesthetic you're going for. A book corner. I've wanted this for a while, but my room does not have a corner for me to place books in. Books, search some on TikTok. There's a ton of recommendations that are wonderful on TikTok. Shelves, I just have a little shelf, but I'm looking to get a bigger shelf because I want to grow my book collection. Some miscellaneous items are concert tickets. Taylor Swift has her Eras tour coming up next year. Shoulder bags, definitely a staple that everybody needs. Um, tote bags as well. Stuff to do your own nails. So I do my own nails and it, they're so cost effective and they don't take that much effort. Honestly, I'd rather spend less money and more time. A gua sha or a face roller it's to roll your face and make sure that it depuffs. Lastly, some of the gift cards that you guys should put on your list is Barnes & Noble's Amazon, Ulta Beauty, Starbucks, Dunkin', Target. There's also a retail therapy set gift card and they have all different kinds of clothing stores. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope this helped you with adding more things to your Christmas wish list. I have quite an extensive Christmas wish list, but it consists of like most of things that, that I recommended to you guys in this video. So I hope you added some of these recommendations to your Christmas wish list and I hope this video helped you out. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. See you guys next week.